Hi, I'm Cody Miller, Precision Farming Specialist with Sadursky Equipment. On the videos you're about to view, you're going to be able to see our Gen 2, Gen 3 displays from Precision Planning, some setup information, as well as some different products that Precision has, how to set them up and make them perform the best for your, your farming operation. On our Gen 3 2020, in order to add hybrids, uh, we're going to go to the bottom right and hit the setup button. And then on the right hand side here, you're going to have a products tab. So once we get into that, we have seeding on the right. If we had liquid products in there, you'd be able to assign them as well. But we're just going to click on, um, on hybrid A here on the left. So once we have that, we have an option to either add from a database or add a custom hybrid. So we're going to try going from a database here. So I'm just going to type in a hybrid here. Um, any of uh, most manufacturers that are out there today are going to be uh, available in this database. So if we just click on um, this hybrid that I picked, we can assign it to uh, a list of rows. So if you're doing a test plot and you have uh, different rows, you can assign it to that. Or else if you're doing a split planner, you can also uh, assign it left or right or else to all the rows. So once that's assigned, or uh, you, you select that, uh, you can actually tie the shape of the seed, lot number, so if you need to go back and track if there's germination issues, you can do that. Uh, we're going to click done once all that info is put into there. And then whatever color that hybrid is, it will actually show you up at the top here um, what, what color is associated with that hybrid. So if we go back to hybrid B here, that is already in there, I'm just going to add another, another hybrid in here quick. So now we're going to assign it to the right. So now if we go back into the screen, you can see the left has got this hybrid, the right has that hybrid. So very easy to add multiple hybrids. We can add up to four hybrids per planter pass in order to keep track of that for you for your data.